This is the finisher workout. Great workout to finish a week or after a workout to get a cardio element into your training if you've been doing something like a weights workout. We're gonna go for six exercises, 30 seconds on, 10 seconds in between, some quite up-tempo variations, so there's gonna be options to scale it back as well. And we're looking at doing two, three, or four rounds of this workout. So, those exercises. Starting off with one and a half squats and adding a jump if we want. So we're down, back up, down again, popping out. Down, back up, popping out. You can take away the jump and just keep it that little bit less dynamic if that is a better option for you as you go through the rounds or you go through each set at a time. Then we're gonna take it down, up and down plank, little pause, want to upscale it, we add a press up as well in the top position. Or we'll just go around in the plank. Then we're gonna bring it up into some jumping jacks, getting that cardio going. Next up, we're gonna go for out and up, reverse crunches. We're gonna push it out and push it up. And then we're gonna come up, make it more dynamic. Squat jacks, in and out, touching down with each hand, just going to a comfortable depth. So if that means your foot, hand doesn't touch the floor, that is okay. Finally, we're gonna work through with the high knees. So upset, squat first, one and a half squats. Down, part up, back down, and up, or adding that little jump if you want as well. Extra tension in the bottom with this half movement. And we can take in, add the jump or take it out as you go through the set and through the rounds. And here, keep moving. Nice. Take it down then, up and down plank. Add in the press up if you want. Add in the press up there, but you don't need to do that. Just keep moving with the plank. Go in next, jumping jacks. Take it down then, out and up, reverse crunch, get the abs working, so push out, push up, get those hips up just a touch, get the work into the lower abs, nice and controlled, steady on this one. This gets too intense, so switch it to a regular crunch. So we're going to be working into those abs. Oh, we're cool. Squat jacks, so we're popping in and out, reaching down. You have to reach all the way to the floor, but let's keep it dynamic, keep it moving.
Ah, finishing this round with the high knees. Here we go. There we are then. So, taking this back and going around once, twice, or three times more, making two, three, or four sets for this finisher workout. 